Hi, my name is Adam Top. In the previous video, we looked at bachata dance timing, specifically dancing bachata on all beats, as it is common to do in the Dominican Republic. In this video, we're going to add a little twist, and that's that it is often the follow that starts or initiates the dance in the Dominican Republic, and thus, in a sense, determines the timing because they're starting the dance. So what happens is the follow starts the dance, starts dancing on whatever timing they would like, and the lead then picks up that timing, okay? Now after that occurs, the lead goes ahead and leads the dance as normal. Um, but what it means is that when dancing in the Dominican Republic, both leads and follows need to be versatile and in a sense able to dance on multiple beats, okay? So follows, when you look at dance floors, I would say follows, initiate, or start the dance a majority of the time. Now this doesn't happen 100% of the time. There are times when the lead does start or initiate the dance. Perhaps they'll start it with a half step touch and then they'll, they'll start the dance. In these videos I want you to pay attention to the different couples as they start their dance and try to make up your own mind who is starting the dance first. Now a really nice aspect of the follow starting the dance is the follow is dancing then on a timing that they feel and that they feel comfortable with and the lead is dancing to that timing. Okay, and is versatile and flexible in dancing to a timing that the follow feels comfortable with. Now that's something that can be put into practice whether the follow initiates or the lead initiates. If the lead is initiating, um, obviously you are you can't read the follow's mind, but you're ideally dancing on a beat or a timing that the follow feels comfortable on. Now, how will you use this information in the future in your own dancing? Well, certainly it's going to come in handy if you dance in the Dominican Republic. Now as a lead, it's very important to know that the follow oftentimes will initiate the timing and I should get on her timing. 
Um, now, how to apply this internationally around the world where the norm is for the lead to start or initiate the dance um, and thus determine the timing. Uh, that's something maybe a little more complicated. Certainly, I don't think it's necessary to go and change the social dance norms um, internationally and have uh, the follows always start the bachata. What I do think is important and sort of at the root of the follows starting in the Dominican Republic as well is the fact that the follow is dancing on a timing that they feel musically and that they feel comfortable with. Okay, now this is, that's a concept that can be applied whether you are having the, whether the follow is starting or whether the lead is starting. The idea that the follow is dancing on a timing that they feel and that they feel very comfortable dancing on. Okay.